It's 9.08 p.m. Friday, October 15, 2021. I want to show you this, what's going on live. Nothing. Crazy. Look at that. No sound. That's not the eeriest thing you've ever seen, cons considering all the action that's going on and the earthquakes getting larger and all the eruptions. That thing has just gone dead silent. I haven't checked any live, live feeds for several hours here after doing those videos I just did. But as soon as I turn this on, I just wanted to go right on here and show this. I mean, it's unbelievable. I mean, is that actually they're showing the volcano? It has to be, right? It's not some side view way far away. I don't think so. Let me go back a little bit and see. Oh my gosh. That's from an hour and a half ago. This is three hours ago. This is six hours ago. Yeah, they're showing it. Look at that. Let's go back. Try to... That was seven hours ago. What time is it? Nine? So that means it's 2 p.m. No. Yeah. So that this is showing when it was just starting to get dark there. It is cold stone dead. Look at that. Let's go ahead. Oh my gosh, let's move it ahead. That's four or five hours ago, let's go ahead. That looks like a cross too, a tiny bit. That's, when is that? Two and a half hours ago? There, it looks like a cross is forming again. I guess this is the live feed. Whatever's going on has to be. Yeah, look, it looks like a cross again, and it's just the only thing on the whole screen. That's crazy. I didn't check any other live feeds, so I don't think this is some kind of te technical problem here. I wouldn't imagine it is because I went back and back and back and it was all quiet. I think that the next thing that happens here is going to be major and maybe not just with this volcano, maybe the one up north also. Still looks like a cross. <laughs> I don't know, maybe this is the final, final warning. Again, I want, I want to repeat, we're not going to be here, so if you hear me talking about all these things and these possible days here. First of all, I'm not saying what day or anything or if anything's going to happen. And I believe we're not going to be here. And this is a this is a judgment, I believe. I've seen all the angels everywhere. I filmed some my my camera and my means are very poor here. Otherwise, if I had really good equipment and knew how to do it, I would 
I would show better footage, but it's what it is. Let's see. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with it. That's on high, the audio on YouTube. And that's 100%. My s computer is on 100% audio up high sound. Wow. And something's got to give here. Something has to give. I want to go way up to this part. Way 12 hours ago. Let's see what there is. Nothing. Stillness. Wow. Just white screen. Let's go up ahead. White screen. Here, maybe I could show you this, the sun simula simulator. Because it looks like it's going to go dark really quick here. Let me see if I could go back. Because, my, again, my laptop is facing the opposite direction. I have to go over around it to show you this. Figure out which arrow is which. I have to go back. So this is the key. Look, it still looks like a cross a bit. It's the only thing there. I'm trying to get twilight. I, I, ooh. I'll get it. Hold on a second. I have to go back pretty far. All right, somewhere around here. I want to show you if, if it happens. You can see what I'm talking about with this, this artificial light blinks dimming on and off. Let me figure this out again. To go ahead. Yeah, just bear with me if you can. Let's see. Okay. I have to go ahead. I'll get there. It's going to take a little while, but... I want to show you. Maybe it'll go right from light to dark. I have a lot of footage of that. not cooperating. There was a flash on the top left. I, if you could see it, I don't know if you can with the screen. Flames. But still dead silent. Looks like lava up there. I don't know what's going on. Unless they're messing around with the sound. I don't know, that's possible for some reason. They don't want to, whatever. I have no idea. Now maybe you could see the top left there. I don't know, or maybe their sound is off. I don't know, they turned it off or low or something. There, now it's getting... dark. I want to show you something. That was 20 seconds. Does it get dark that dark in 20 seconds? Let's see. 5 seconds, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 45, 50. That's a minute.
All right, that's two minutes. I don't know. Three. Anyway, that's three minutes, and it looks much darker after three minutes. So let's go back two more minutes if you want to wait on this. That's four minutes. Oh, of course. Oh, I guess I messed up. Anyway. Let's see. I don't know, it got awful dark. It's six minus six thirty. Minus six twenty four. So that's six minutes. Look how dark it got. That's seven minutes. It got much darker. It's like not even 10 minutes, it got totally dark. That's not natural. Look at that. Six fourteen. That's within 15 minutes. 14, that's 12, within 12 minutes it got dark. Look. Approximately. Yeah, in 10 minutes it went from that to that. And I'll show you. There's nothing. See, as I go across, you could probably see there's really nothing. There's something there. That's just lava. There's looks like the cross again. Dogs barking. See that? I'm going up through the hours. There's nothing. Not a thing. Not a... Wow. Let's put it on live. That's all there is. It's like a grave, a graveyard quiet. Let's see if you want to hang around. There's some comments here. Yeah, let me put this on full screen and maybe we could read some. Let's see. I don't know if you could see it. I'll put this on. All right, you could probably see that, right? Let's go up here. Oh, it's in Spanish. <laughs> well, that's not. Satan is mocking you. Lots of luck. That was in English. Uh, this one says Satan good. Yeah. That's what you think. Anyway, oh well, I don't know if you could see that, you probably could see that if it's not too really blur blurred bright. What you hear is what you hear. That's on full 100%, that's on 100%. So, what I'm going to do here, I switched on to TV Canarias, or Television Canaria, and you could tell there's nothing happening, just a slow magma going down the mountain, no sound, no eruption. Talk about waiting for something to happen. <laughs> Wow. All right, now hold on a second because there's something important I want to show you. This is the channel I've been referring to, which I didn't come back and do any kind of talk about. Okay, now I could talk better. The microphone is properly near my mouth. Let me go out. I don't know if you could see that. Uh, 
un unknown eagle, the official earthquake guy. Now, I don't know, several days ago, um, there was one that he was waiting for. Exactly, he named the town in California, and it was an obscure town near the coast. And I couldn't believe it. He named it beforehand, and it, the center of, of the um, earthquake was right at the town that he named, right at it. And you, I don't know if you could read this, <clears throat> but he has, right now it says, La Palma, Spain, eruption and high magnitude earthquake warning, 1016 through 1122, but that's not the only one because there's multiple asteroids that he follows that are going to be affecting, or are right the second in, at different times, affecting the world, and especially La Palma. Here's another warning. Italy, Vesuvius eruption, warning, 1015, 21 through 1124, and then also La Palma, high magnitude earthquake warning. The next one, here it is again, La Palma, high altitude earthquake warning, and he names the, the asteroid, 1015 to 1017. The one before that, same thing, or maybe a different one, but same High magnitude warning, this is what, a day ago. High magnitude earthquake warning for La Palma, Spain, and California, 1017 through uh, the 24th. So these are all different asteroids. La Palma, Spain, high magnitude earthquake watch. This is a different one, 17th. F1. I didn't get to listen to him because today his the videos sometimes they're very long and he speaks very little but the few words he does say to that address you know what might happen are very incredible and powerful that's why I listen so if you listen to him he's doing calculations most of the time and he he is always looking at the con uh, you know the chat room and he converses with with others answers their question and t questions and talks to them through you know on and off uh, he answers what they wrote so he's talking and then they go back and forth sometimes but look for the it just keeps going every every video here high qu magnitude quake warning for la palma So that's all I'm going to say, but I wasn't, I told you in the last video what he, basically what he said, he's expecting the roof to cave in on this situation there, the 17th and the 18th, up to the, up, I guess, up to the 20th. And I told you what, you know, basically what he had said, he thinks the large, cone, the large volcano up north is going to totally massively erupt and giant quakes. And he did mention tsunami, but I don't know if, I don't know if it's because like if it strikes and it could, um, in other words, if there's a big volcano, like if we, a big earthquake, like we hear there you know reports there's an earth there's a 7.0 let's say in Alaska and there's a tsunami warning um, issued and then usually nothing happens thankfully so that's the type of thing either either that's what he meant but he did mention and he thinks there's going to be a tsunami whether it's just from the earthquake itself and I, I I'm not sure as far as the land breaking off, if that relates to that or not. 
I, I think it does. I really do. I think that's what. I know that's what he's what he said, but I'm not. That's basically what what he is expecting. Really, very soon here. I mean, of course, it could be wrong, but that's what he said. Seventeenth and eighteenth. He expects this this to to go down. So, um, I'm kind of going slowly here because it's it's kind of upsetting and and exasperating and sad. You know, because I. It seems like this is about to happen, and again, I want to restate it that I don't believe we're going to be here, even if this does happen. There's no saying that it will um, in this time frame. Do I believe it more strongly than not? Yeah, I do. I believe this could be the, the moment here. I truly do. And um, so take it for what it's worth. I mean... As far as the rapture goes, I, again, I believe we're we're leaving here. We're not. If something like this is going down, I, I believe 100% we're not going to be here for that. That's a that's a judgment, total judgment. Um, even though I don't want to get into this now, you know, might might say, well, God isn't doing this. It's being, you know, brought upon man by man. I'm not going to get into all that here, but regardless, the effects of it and the church, you know, the the fate of the church and prophecy and the start of the tribulation and what's going on with the, with the thing in the arm, the thigmajigger, is very getting totally out of hand and serious. And it's the point I believe it is with, for everything. It's the time to, to to go. It really is. I wouldn't be surprised if we're out of here. I'm not going to... Again, if I say something, you know, I'm not going to be held to any specific day. But considering what I just showed you with the the silent, the dormant, quiet, dark landscape of what what's happened with... La Palma right now with Cumre Vieja just sitting there totally dead and that this is not likely this is not because it's suddenly shut off and because it's going away um, so I just want to offer hope absolutely offer hope I have no doubt if anything like this happens, we're, we'll be taken. We, we will be taken. We'll be gone. Absolutely. And uh, what else was I going to say? <sighs> Let me shut this off a second. Yeah, I guess at these last kind of moments here, what I wanted to say is, you know, you're going to hear differing opinions prophetically. Some are so adamant that we're in the tribulation, you know, the rapture's not going to happen here. We have to go through things first. Um, so you're going to be hearing things like that, and I'm, I don't, I don't go with go for that. Um, we're going to be gone. The rapture happens first. We're not in the tribulation. You'll hear that too. We're in the tribulation. Or you'll hear people getting very upset that the you know what is the mark, the mark of the beast. Well, it it definitely is the start of the progress of that. It's not the mark. It can't be because we we're. It's not going to happen to believers, and it has to happen during the tribulation, and it has to go in the right hand or forehead, and there has to be an antichrist here to force everyone to take it. Now, other, others are getting upset, saying that if, if it's being said, you know, preached or taught, that this is not the mark in the sense that 
you could you could get this you know what and it's safe or what have you that's their that's their point that's but it's not the mark itself and it's not gonna see I don't want to I don't want to state this but they're afraid that those who took this already received the mark and they're damned I don't believe that whatsoever you have to be born again it's by the grace of God by Jesus and I'll say it again and I'm not popular here and it's not going to be popular if I keep saying these things. It's only by grace. It always was, always will be in the tribulation also. There's no other way to be saved. So if a person saved by Jesus' blood and born again, born of his spirit, by his grace solely, not just through intellect, not just through doctrine, not just through claiming it, but actually have been transformed inwardly and Jesus is in them, he dwells within Christ in you, the hope of glory. He's the only hope and the whole only righteousness that we have. And we cannot lose salvation once we have him, once we have him in us. It's an occurrence. It's him being in us. It's life, his life in us. That's all, that's what it is. You know, so many are, are doing works and trying to keep their, keep their salvation and prove, prove their faith. And so that's why they have this mentality toward the tribulation and those who, who took this you know what in their arm because everything is a work to a work to them and if you don't do the work then you lose it no that's not true even in the tribulation if you are born again no matter what you're you're saved no matter what happens so i mean i get a strong feeling this is something's about i keep saying it this is going to go this situation is about to go I believe we're out of here. I totally do. The last, I would say, almost two weeks, I've noticed, especially going outside at night, the air seems so tense. I don't know how to give an account for it, but it's just been tense, like a tension, and like something's going to happen. It's been this way for, for quite a while now. It's uneasiness. I mean, I'm not uneasy, but I sense it in the air. It's like something is going to happen. It's like the same feeling here. Me in New Jersey, I feel the same sense of what's going on over there with La Palma Earth uh, Volcano. But as I said, I've, I've also had this feeling come over me for a long time now, actually months, of a very special, unique kind of thing that I feel just um again it's it's something good something unexplainable on the other hand so i think that's what's going on it's, it's we're going to be out of here it's the rapture it's the rapture we're going i can't say no one can say if anything will happen in the next few days here or you know several several days or whatever but i feel it with everything inside of me right here right now sitting here the same peace quietness but tension that you could see on the screen when you look at what's the current live stream from La Palma especially earlier through the through you know the day over there I, that I just showed you there was nothing nothing at all just dead so there is that looming kind of expectation of something here like like you just sense it you just know it it's just there it's strong. This is going to happen. I really do. I believe it. So before I go, I'll just say that once more, if this is, happens to become my last video for, for whatever reason, there's a motorcycle, and I'll just mention it again. So I never know which one of these might be my last video for whatever reason, whether we're leaving here, and that's the reason, or I'm just not allowed to be up on here anymore. So if I'm still here, you know, able to do a video, if something happens tonight or tomorrow, I'm going to be here as long as I'm here. But you, you, could, you could cut the tension like with a knife, it's so thick. That's saying, you just, it's so laden in the air, the sensation of something going down. It really is. <laughs> I think you could sense it too. 
All right, so I'm going to try to record, not record, but um, I'm going to try to load this. I doubt it will load. Uh, maybe I could go somewhere now to load it. It's still pretty early, and I'll put this on too. Uh, this could be the very last string of videos I do here. I didn't expect to come back here again. I said I was hanging up my teaching shoes, handed in the keys, and you know, put the certificate away in a box. So I basically did that. And that's what I meant by that, by not be doing any more videos. But I think I was shown so much stuff here and, and you know, to come back here is what I'm saying, to be on here in this form, in this way, dealing with this volcano and prophetically and, and Jesus return. And I believe we're right at the door, right at the door here. So... I'll, I'll try. I'll try, and I will, as far as I know and can. Uh, I'll be here as this progresses here, and I don't think it's very long. I think all the warnings have gone out in every way, including with this volcano, and any of those reports that you hear out there up, up on a hill that they, basically everything's okay. Um, so I think within a couple days we're going to find out. You know, if this really, <laughs> if it's if it's going to go down, we'll find out any minute here. If I see anything, if I hear anything, uh, I'll probably be back on here. Eastern time. Usually I'm up late almost till morning, till daybreak. I don't know, it depends on my sleep, how it goes. But I do expect something major to happen any moment here. Maybe by tonight, maybe tomorrow. And much, much more the next day. Again, I mentioned 17th and 18th. It's not a prediction. I'm just going by certain things that might affect the volcano, you know, around that time, whether anything happens or not, okay? All right. I'll see you later. Bye. I just want to give you a little glimpse here. He's on now. He's been on every for hours and hours every every day. <laughs> 